Good morning everyone. So as I promised, the first order of business on my Saturday morning <clears throat> is to announce the winners of the 21 Draw with Jazza competition. Uh, before I reveal the three winners, I just want to thank everyone who participated. There were hundreds and hundreds of people who took the time out of their day and many of which stepped outside of their comfort zone to take a selfie with their art, you know, whether it be the fact that they don't normally like to put pictures of themselves around the place um, and a lot of them covered themselves up and that's fine um, and then also the the fact that people can be can feel vulnerable about their art so I really appreciate that, that everyone who participated really um, put themselves out there and I'm so glad that we have such an awesome artistic community where everyone's just so supportive of each other and just seeing everyone's kind support of each other it's just amazing but anyways on to the winners winner number one on twitter is the fabulous tigra congratulations winner number two also on twitter is various dragobert i don't know how to say that sorry but um congratulations as well also on twitter and our final winner on instagram this time is rsj creations I know there's going to be a lot of questions about how I actually judged this one and to be honest it was more difficult than the challenge of the month in a lot of regards because I told myself I didn't want to judge it solely based on skill. You know, um, the the 21 draw book and the, the whole how to draw thing, you know, it's really about developing but um, I think aside from picking people who obviously challenge themselves, the content of the piece and the stylistic approach of people, you know, will the book help these people or will it who will it offer most value to while these while picking artists who are at a stage where it will also be uh, interpreted easily as well you know so um, there are a lot of different factors and and I was careful to judge them as as best as I could um, but at the end of the day a, a competition like this and the challenges of the month they are subject to my opinion and approach which is mine and some of yours might be different but I hope you understand the decision and a huge congratulations and thank you to our three winners and everyone else who's participated I found a sneaky bubba what are you doing in the cupboard what are you doing in the cupboard MJ do you want to watch a cartoon? Yeah. Yeah? Come here, let's watch a cartoon. Ah! What are you doing here? Ah! Hi! Hey. Good morning, Master. Uh, I thought I'd warm up a little. Ah! Huh? You're stuck. Stuck? No. Nah. We're quiet in combat. <laughs> Mrs. Jazz is feeling a bit under the weather, so MJ and I going for a bit of a walk. We might get a little hot chocolate or something. Uh, and she's having a bit of a snooze and hopefully she's gonna get a bit better after that. Just starting to get a bit of a, not a cold, but it's like chesty, fluey, crappy thing. So we'll go have our own little afternoon frolic and then when we get back in the evening, we'll all have a nice evening and dinner and relax together. So that'll be good. That's good dancing, Baba. Good dancing. So daddy has a coffee and we got a little hot chocolate for MJ. We can have a little bit at a time, okay? Because otherwise we'll get too messy. Ready? Do you want some? Do you want to sit there? Do you want to sit on the chair? Okay. Zoom. Okay. Ready? Do you want a drink? Do you want to hold it? Do you want to hold it by yourself? You got it? Careful. <laughs> You're a bit grown up. I think he's got it. We were walking by the shop and I saw this picture of a man dressed in flannelette pyjamas. I just imagine his modelling career isn't taking off, that his modelling flannelette pyjamas at the discount shop. I think his eyes sort of scream kill me. 
<laughs> We're visiting Granny and Grandpa. Oh no, here goes Crazy Daisy. <laughs> oh no, Crazy Daisy, so crazy. Look at her, look at her. <laughs> She's mental. <laughs> crazy Daisy. <laughs> MJ's encouraging her craziness. I want a clementine. They're not ripe, dearie. I still want one. Run, run from Crazy Daisy. <laughs> run, run for your life. <laughs> Look at that, that is the face of menacing, troublemaking Crazy Daisy. Oh, she wants to... Oh no, she's coming for me. Ah! Mrs. Jazz is looking at replacing the dog bed because the dog has this really weird habit. It's her only bad habit. It's her only bad habit. She's a real little lady of a, of a dog. She's like this sweet little old lady, but she randomly makes out with her couch. Look at that. Well, give her a break. She just, she just, She's an old lady. She just licks it and pashes on with it. <laughs> oh, I love you, Eduardo. Let's run away together. <laughs> Maybe she's lonely, poor old thing. Oh, sweetheart. It's okay. She's always loved the couch. <laughs> she loves her couch. But she's loved other couches before, though. She... <laughs> her pony's dead. She used to love our big sofas when she was young enough to get on them. That was gross. <laughs> she's found one more her size now. Thank God. But it's, it's sort of... Put it in a bit of a state. <laughs> She's slowly disintegrating the couch by making out she with it. She doesn't wreck it, it just makes it crusty. Yeah, I wouldn't sit on it. <laughs> I think it's sort of her couch now. It's not really for people though, let's be honest. Although MJ likes it. Not sure I like him liking it now though. 